Good day or night, or whenever you're watching this, it is currently 5 o'clock p.m. today. As you guys read from the title, we are doing a night routine in our new home. A night routine in a new area, in a new spot. It's a little different now. She's older. Baby, come here. Look over there. Baby. Look behind Dada. Oh. Look behind Dada. Look at this. Go get it. Go get it. I'm gonna yeah. get you. Go get it. Go get it. I brought your toy out here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Good job. I am going to be making dinner and I'm gonna tell Steven what I am making right now. Yes. I am going to make. What do you think? Noodles. No. I have no idea. <laughs> Meatballs! Woo! I love meatballs. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I'm gonna be making some grape jelly meatballs. They sound really gross, but they're That's actually exactly so what good. I thought the first time Madeline said she was gonna make grape jelly meatballs, I was like, are you serious? Yeah. But they are so bomb. He's they're... been asking for me to make them since I was pregnant, and I just was grossed out by it when I was pregnant, so I never made them. But I'm not pregnant anymore, so I figured I would make them tonight. I'm gonna make some meatballs. We got my instant pot out. We're gonna add grape jelly to the pot. In here, I'm not even gonna like measure. Barbecue sauce. Like I said, it's, it's gonna sound gross. I'm doing like kind of half the recipe right now, so. I'm gonna do three fourths cup of water. Mix that in. Now, we're gonna get some meatballs. And then we're just gonna start this and I'll be back whenever it's done. I had the meatballs on high for five minutes. We're now gonna do this part, it's really scary. Be prepared, one, two, three. Wow! Luna came immediately over here. That's called steam. That is the instant pot, releasing the air. I am making some instant mashed potatoes, you know, making it as easy as possible tonight. Okay, honestly, people that hate on instant mashed potatoes are hilarious to me because instant mashed potatoes are so, so good. Like, I love this stuff. Honestly, low key more than like regular mashed potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> I got Steven and I something fun to do. Close your eyes. They're closed. I got this. Ready? Three, yeah. two, one. <gasps> Giant coloring pages of Pokemon, oh my gosh. Yeah, we can do this at night. That is awesome. Really fun. That is awesome. Yeah, and I got the crayons too. The what? The crayons. 64 pack because Dang. you know, we're bougie. Also look. Has a pencil sharpener. No way. Yeah. I'm gonna add these in, it's kind of fun. It's like making instant snow. <laughs> Goes in dry, then you stir it. It looks disgusting, but it's so good. Look at it. Two cups. That's how easy it is. One of my favorite things to do at family functions is say, oh man, these potatoes are so good, are they instant? And everybody's like, ah, Oh my gosh, no. Making mashed potatoes takes forever. Yeah, and so it just kind of gets, it catches everybody off guard and they're like, oh, 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 I spent so long on this, but yeah. Ooh, and the paper plates. I bought new ones. What's... I'm gonna show you guys a way to organize your silverware drawer. Instead of stacking them, you like put them all to the side and then you just Yeah, I love the method. And then with uh, knives, I go one up and then one down. Dinner is served. <laughs> they hot? <laughs> yeah, but they taste delicious. I'm gonna go get some mashed potatoes. We're gonna give Luna some mashed potatoes. I'm just gonna put it straight on the tray. Can you eat it? Mm. <laughs> you don't like it? Every time we give it to her, she doesn't like you it. You don't like mashed potatoes? I don't know if it's the consistency or what. Camp's starting up the bath right now. We're actually live on TikTok, so if you guys uh, wanna go follow us on there, we go live sometimes. We kinda wanna do it more often. We're just talking with you guys on there. 
while the bath is filling up, I'm gonna come into Luna's room, grab some things that need to get done. So I have, so I have her empty bottle from earlier and just kind of get a spot ready. So whenever Luna does get out of the bath, we don't have to like scrounge for materials. So I'm gonna get a diaper out. Her wipes are already out. We got some Aquaphor. We need something for her to sleep in. Let's see here. Madeline really likes her and this like mustard yellow stuff, so. This is just so cute. It's got like little llamas on it. Super cute. That's what she's gonna wear to bed. And then her sleep sack, I need to find. I think it's out there. I got Luna in the bath. We're gonna still on TikTok live and then get this girl cleaned up and ready for bed. She's all clean and ready for bed. Not ready for bed quite yet. All Steven plays with her. I am going to get laundry started because I am a little bit behind on that. Got that, our laundry detergent. Start the wash. Now I'm gonna go play with Luna. We're gonna play. We got our new Love Every Play Kit. So we have a bunch of new toys to play with. I'm excited. While Madeline and Luna are playing, I am gonna get bottles ready for tonight. We got one, two, three, four. And I'm not making four bottles. I'm filling them up with water. She won't use all four of these bottles, but I'm gonna make one for when she goes to bed. Another one for like 11 o'clock at night when she gets hungry. And then sometimes she'll eat at like four and then we make one more just for the next day. Just gonna fill it up with water and then pre-fill up this formula can just so we don't have to do it in the middle of the night. Just be scrambling for stuff. We already have it ready. I got an eight ounce bottle for right before she goes to bed and three five ounces just for backups. There's our eight ounce and then the rest are five ounces. These three bottles will be in our room this one will stay out here. We'll bring that into our room after this bottle is filled. Give her a breather, Mom. Okay, okay, we're done. We're done. <laughs> Steven is going to do our Pokemon Go for the day. We forgot to, so he's got to go to a route. If you didn't know, right now Mateo is out. It's like a new guy, maybe. I don't know, but we're supposed to trade with him, trade gifts with him. So we didn't do a route, so I'm gonna go do that really quick. And then we have to go spin a Pokestop because there's like a thing that we do every day. Haven't done that yet. So I got Madeline's phone on me. I'm about to go do a route, spin a stop. Steven is still out playing Pokemon for us, but I'm getting Luna ready for bed. Sorry, you guys can't really see. I just don't want it super bright in here. But I'm trying to chill her out a little bit. Here's your bottle. Bottle. All right, well, I'm gonna go feed her, get her to sleep. I'm gonna go turn off that light over there. Good night to Luna, but I still gotta shower and do all my other things for night. Okay, so I just moved over the laundry to the dryer, but now I am gonna hop in the shower and then Steven and I are gonna finish Squid Games tonight. Yeah, I think we're gonna finish Squid Game tonight. Like I said in the last video, we are so far behind on the trend, uh, like two years behind, <laughs> but we finally started watching it because the challenge came out and we really liked that. So we're like, okay, maybe we should actually give it a try. And we actually really liked it. Anyway, I'm gonna go hop in the shower. We'll see you guys after that. And I think Steven has to shower too, maybe. It is currently 8.45. I just got out of the shower, as you can tell. And Luna just woke up for the first time. Um, Steven got her back to sleep though, so she's golden. 
and we are about to turn on Squid Game. So right now we are watching Squid Game. This is the final episode. We got the Pokemon coloring board out. We're about to color with that. Luna woke up several times. Um, we think that this time she's actually teething. We're like, man. Like whenever we were going to Missouri, we we're like, yeah, she's got to be teething. We say it all the time, but like, we don't know what it's like. She hasn't got a tooth yet. Yeah. So like, we're like, oh, this has to be teething. But the reason why I'm actually thinking that it is this time is because it's just been like so random and like these outbursts of like crying, which she just doesn't do. Also, she isn't. 10 months old. It's about time for her. Madeline and I were both a year old when we got our first tooth, so it makes sense for her to be a little late to the tooth game. That's what makes me think that it's teething. Hello. We were, so we were about to go color because we didn't get to color last night and it came to our attention and we realized that we did not finish last night's vlog. So it was pretty rough night for Luna. She kept waking up. She was not a happy camper yeah. and we did not feel like it would be right to film that because no. we needed to obviously tend to her and we didn't want to have to turn on lights and get a good angle and all of that stuff. So we did not finish last night, but just know it was a rough night for a little girl. Yeah. Yeah, but she, she was, was hurting. She was so much better today, though. Yeah. Um, and also tonight she went to sleep pretty easily. So let's hope she stays asleep. Well, we're going to finish coloring and we hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you did, please do not forget to give it a like. Make sure to subscribe down below and hit that bell so you get notified every single time that we post a new video. We love you guys so very much. Oh, wait, we finished Squid Game. It was really good series. Um, pretty Can't wait brutal. for season two. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty brutal. Um, but it was very very good. It was good. We finally got on the bandwagon. We love you guys so, so very much. Don't forget to be kind and we hope to see you guys in our next video. Bye, Bye guys. guys.